UTEP has had a story track history for years now, but this past weekend, UTEP's pedigree was taken up a notch. But Emmanuel career is coming away. Toby Amosan is going to win. Jamaica has now taken over the second place position. Miners past and present, picking apart the competition and lighting up the track all weekend long at the World Athletics Championship. Yeah, it was pretty clear early on that they go do some different things, so bigger and better things. Since her time at UTEP in 2016, Toby Amasant has been working to capture the world's attention. This race, the 2016 NCAA Outdoor 100 meter hurdles. Toby Amusan, the freshman from Texas El Paso, was right there. But the Nigerian flyer always craved more. Later that year, Amasan tweeted this, quote, unknown now, but soon I will be unforgettable. I will persist until I succeed. On Sunday, the former miner's desires she mentioned in that 2016 tweet came to fruition. Amasan breaking a six-year-old world record in her semi-final. World record! World record! Then winning the final just two hours later and breaking the record she set earlier with a wind-aided time of 12.06. Toby Amazon, look at the clock! I cannot believe it! She's done it again! Amasan now the first Nigerian to ever win a world championship. She's now the fastest woman in the entire history of the world to ever race in the 100 meter hurdles. The CCK is a pretty special young lady and she's been progressing nicely, but, but this is kind of, this is a pretty huge drop in her, her personal best time at, at that kind of event and set a world record. So, so I don't think anybody saw that coming. Many though might have seen this coming. 2017 minor and last year's Olympic gold medalist Emmanuel Correa taking home gold in the 800 meters. Becomes the world champion. That's very unique. I don't think we had that, that those kind of performance in the past. The minor fire over the weekend kept burning with current UTEP track star Javon Powell. The Jamaican bringing home silver for his part in the men's 4x400 relay. Here's a good meet for us. Good? Might be an understatement, but what exactly will the miners' stellar showing over the weekend mean for the future success of the program? So that's a good sign, but I think what what uh, prospects nowadays look for they 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 want a bunch of bells and whistles. So so yeah, that's that ch checks out the part that oh, check, like coaxing is here and you can develop here, but then, then they start looking. Their performances call for a major picks up and just keep the picks up because 33 days UTEP football begins. That's your look at sports. Got more news after the break.